Here's how social media can completely destroy your divorce case. I'm Steve Kramer. I'm a Florida family law and divorce attorney. And today we're going to talk about the role of social media in divorce. The bottom line is everything you do in the digital world and on the internet is out there. It's in the public domain. My advice when it comes to operating a Facebook account, LinkedIn, email, Twitter is to be very cautious. And in many, many situations, the best thing you can do, especially when it comes to your Facebook account, is shut it down during the course of your divorce. Now, if you're not willing to do that, if social media is very important to you, then you definitely need to be careful. One, you want to limit access, all right? That means Definitely changing passwords because you don't want your spouse snooping in there if they've got your password. You don't want anybody hacking in there. Make sure you've got a good, strong password that is updated. Two, be aware of posting. Be aware of what you post. Know that anything you post, other people can see. And your spouse doesn't have to see it. It can be their friend. It can be somebody else. Anybody who can see it. And aside from that, those records might get subpoenaed. That means you might be ordered to turn them over. Even if nobody that you could possibly foresee looking at it can see it, it still might come into play in your case. Now, the other thing you have to look at is not only your postings, but other people's postings. Somebody else could post something on your Facebook that could be detrimental. Maybe you were having an affair or you're in another relationship outside of your marriage and they post information, oh honey, thanks for taking me on that vacation. And they think it's okay because you're separated from your spouse. It's already out there, divorce has been filed. Well, I'm here to tell you that that's not the case. It could have a negative impact on your divorce case. The other thing you might wanna look out for is watching your geolocator, all right? If you're using applications that have a geolocator, meaning they tell people where you're at, well, that could expose you to some problems. You might not want your spouse to be aware of where you're going, when you're leaving, what you're doing, how you're earning your money, whatever. You're gonna have to turn over lots of records Uh, There's no reason to open yourself up for additional exposure, so be cautious. I've seen social media have a huge impact, especially in the past three to four years. It has changed the face of divorce, so be very, very careful when it comes to social media. Why am I telling you this? Because I deal with these issues every day. I've seen the impact that social media can have on divorce cases, and I'm here to help. If you have any questions, give me a call. I'd love to talk with you. I'm Steve Kramer. Thanks for watching.